the good people that are out here doing the good things. Like Burke said down in Louisiana when he came up to our last one, there's two types of people in this world. There's good people and there's bad people. <laughs> We're here today to support the good people. So we put together something. It's not real big, it's not huge, but I feel like the meaning behind it is a big meaning. I've been here, it's personal to me. I cry every time, so whoever's laughing, zip it. <laughs> um, this right here, for people that don't know, this is a rod and piston. They come out of the fastest small block motor on the East Coast. We put it together, we made a trophy out of it, and it's, it's actually like an award or something to remember. It, um, contrary to belief, a motor will run without one of these. It will run for a very short and brief amount of time before it slings the motor apart and blows up completely. So this represents the police department as a whole. Because believe it or not, the community will run without the police department, but only a short and brief amount of time before the community falls completely apart. These are the guys that have our backs. And as NC Mustang Mafia, we want to have your backs, and we will always have your back and support you in every way possible. It feels funny calling him Chief up here because me and him were on the streets together, on the SWAT team together, and he was Travis to me for years and years, but he's earned it, so Chief, we appreciate you. Appreciate you letting us come out and do this. So, like I said, I know it's not much, but if you guys come in, put it where your guys can see it. If they feel like they're not making a difference, just know that they're that rod piston, and if they're not in this, then it's going to fall apart. No, sir. Have at it. Hey, I want to thank, well, first off, my name is Travis Stroud. I'm the Interim Chief of Police from the High Point Police Department. I've been here for about 25 years now. Um, and I cannot thank you enough for your support being here today. It was so impressive when my son and I pulled up just a little bit ago to watch our parking lot and how it was filled up uh, with these cars and all the friendliness in the parking lot. Um, that's a big thing for us. It really is. Uh, if you look around, if you're remotely paying attention to what's going on across the country, and there's a lot of chaos, but we do not see that here. The support for us as our police department has been through the roof, and this is just another example of it. You know, today, I'm going to be honest with you, it is personal. It's personal for me, too. Uh, Darren and I used to run around together many moves ago out here on these streets, and, uh, you know, have a hard time. Darren and I, I tell him all the time, we're a lot alike. We really are. Um, I, I look at him and I see me. Back in the day when I was younger. I wish that was that pretty. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I also tell him this. Uh, Darren was one of my favorite officers on the street of all times. He always will be. It will be so hard to talk Darren about for the work that he put in. And you, you guys don't get to see that because times have changed. But I'm telling you, he was he was something else on the street. He did a great work for us. He made a difference. Um, and that's why I loved him. He came in, he punched the clock every single day. And I tell him, I get to see his parents. I told him a minute ago, I get to see his parents every Christmas at a Christmas event. And I tell them too, your son is one of the best. He always will be in my book. Um, and I'm just making that up, and it's true to this day. I get excited when I see him. Um, but he, he and I are a lot alike, so I'm, you better believe that for this award, it is, it's beyond, it really is beyond for me, Mustang Mafia, because he has ties to this, he started it. Um, and so uh, I appreciate the award, and I thank, you know, thanking every single one of you, I really want to thank Darren for the work that you put in, because I know he's for a police, I know this. And here's what I can pledge to you as a police partner. What we do out here, and we do great stuff on an everyday basis, it really has nothing to do with me. But you see those guys, those men and women over there in uniform, they're the ones that are punching the clock every day. And that's the way it rolls down. Uh, and, and in all the unrest that you've seen out there, take COVID. You know how much work we have not done? Nothing. Every single day. We are the true 
24-7-365 unit. And I cannot thank our officers enough for the job they do. I'm glad they're out here. I mean, we're going to start a shift change. They're going to hit the street tonight. Uh, it could go south on us tonight. We have no idea. But I can tell you that. Do this. We're going to do the job right, but we're going to keep on doing it. We're going to fight crime. Uh, we're not going to back down. We're not going to cower down to anybody. We've pledged to do this job, and we will not stop. So thank you, every single one of you coming out here today. I appreciate you. I love Darren Bout. Once again, kudos to you guys.